Hello, what's going on guys? And today I'm showing a gameplay of me getting the mark of the unbroken and some of all cheers. So this just kinda randomly happened to me. I was just playing Crucible as I usually do and suddenly I was just killing everyone. I wasn't dying or anything. And just to be clear, I didn't have a bad connection or anything. I had a perfectly fine connection. And the next thing I know is that I get two of the most rare medals in the game. And I don't know if they Rumble. are the rarest medals middle you can get, but um, I know they are rare. And I know they are hard to get. And you gotta be standing. lucky, or probably good. In my case, I guess I was lucky. Because, you know, I was really playing against some shitty players. However, I did manage to get 22 kills and 0 deaths. Alright, so as you can see I'm using the last word as my primary weapon and as my secondary weapon I use the Fell Winter Sly, aka the, the Iron Banner Shotgun and as my heavy weapon I use Hunger of Corona. So I don't just run around with my shotgun, uh, I mainly use my last word. Uh, I do get a few kills with my shotgun though, um, but I mainly just use my shotgun if I'm about to die or if I'm out of ammo for my last word or something like that. And yes, I do run out of ammo for my last word uh, a couple of times, I believe. And you know, you do run out of ammo when you don't die. Because that's how it is, but... Uh, you, you know, if you didn't know, then all you have to do to get ammo back to your, from your primary weapon, you just have to go pick up some special ammo, special ammo, yeah. And then you will get both special and primary ammo. Alright, so moving on for my heavy weapon, then I'm using the hunk of Crota. And I really didn't want to be using this weapon actually, I'd rather use the uh, against all odds, but at the time of this gameplay I didn't have the gun. However, uh, just after this gameplay I went to buy against all odds. So I have the weapon now, because you know I was basically just farming for some crucible mark so I could get the against all odds. So, uh, so in the future I'm probably going to be using that weapon instead of the hunger of Kuroda. So, do you guys remember the LMG called the Zombie Apocalypse? And some random numbers behind that. But, uh, you know, the LMG Zombie Apocalypse. You could buy it from the Crucible Quartermaster before the DLC came out. And that was one of my favorite LMGs. It had a high, no wait, high impact, slow rate of fire, and the one I had had a really, really good stability. Like, almost maxed out. Maxed out. And it, it is kind of like against all odds, just with the better stability. So it is like two months ago I used it because I dismantled it. And yes, I really do regret that because for the last two months I really didn't have any uh, low weight of fire heavy machine guns that were legendary. So I was forced to use the Song of Fiyud. And you know, I tried, and you know, it didn't really work out. So. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not using that weapon in PvP, I can't do that. Basically, every high rate of fire weapon in the game, I don't know how to use. Unless they inbound. are shotguns. But every high rate of fire auto rifle or LMG, I don't know how to use. So, yeah, that obviously means I didn't know how to use the Song of Fear Yud. And that is basically why I changed to rocket launchers. And I changed to the Hunk of Crota. So now I'm changing back to a legendary low rate of fire LMG. So where I'm going with this is that I'm just wondering which LMG is the best. Some the Apocalypse or Against All Odds. I mean, I, I guess I'm gonna find out. I haven't really used Against All Odds yet, but yeah, I'm really, really looking forward to do it. Alright, so it's kind of at this point of the game, I realized that maybe I can finish this game without dying. Uh, and then, I tried to not die, but you know, I didn't know that was the middle part, so I really didn't take it too seriously. It was just like a challenge for myself. So I just went for it, and tried to get some kills, and you know, it kind of paid out. I don't know what happened here. I guess, yeah, he really had a bad connection, but... Yeah, and I think this is the first time of the game I really used the shotgun, really killed some people with it. And there is finish up the game, and I get Mark of Time Broken and Summer Hall Cheers. And then my opponent gets hotline. And I, he killed like one guy. I don't get it. 
but that is pretty much it guys hope you enjoyed the video and see you in my next one